What's up Tubesters and welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing the most exciting freaking video ever. We are doing a HomeSense haul. <laughs> I can't even express to you how like excited I am about this because one, literally HomeSense opened today and two, I got everything that I've been needing to really bring my home together that I've been like waiting so long to freaking buy because of the fact that like I don't want to buy it online and then I get here and I don't like it and then I have to ship it back so I have been holding off for a few of these items simply because I just want to see it in person and I finally found them. I wasn't even just settling for it because you know it was my first trip out like straight up HomeSense had what I wanted and I'm so happy about it so we are going to dive into it. I spent a little more money than I probably should have, but I've honestly been saving up for this moment. Every time I like have that urge to like buy something online, I don't. Let's just start. The first little item um, is just this cute little pot. I probably won't put anything in it. Like I think I'm gonna actually keep it just the way it is. I just think this is a cute little pot that you can easily put on your shelf. Um, I, I'm hoping to put more shelves in our homes on the bare walls that we have. So this is like more of that. Um, it's also a good little centerpiece for like a coffee table if you have it. I put this on my centerpiece in my dining room table and it actually looks really good so I'm happy about that. I'm really going for earthy tones. You'll kind of notice that once I start showing you more stuff. This next thing is something that I was waiting to see in person because I wanted to make sure that I bought the right size, that it was exactly what I wanted and this is what I'm going to be putting on my coffee table in my living room. I wanted something that I could put like a big floral set in and this is exactly what I wanted. <laughs> It's so funny, like these little things give me so much happiness in life. I'm gonna use it as a vase for a big floral like arrangement because I want like our coffee table to be the big center of attention when you walk into our living room and just kind of look like expensive, but it ain't expensive because this was only $13. But I'm super happy about that. I love it. Now this thing here I got because we're trying to find something to put next to our TV. We don't want to put shelves. We don't want anything bulky. We actually want to keep um, the wall that our TV is on pretty blank. So I got this and it is a um, flower vase holder from the ceiling. It's quite long if you see that, which I'm super happy about because we wanted it to be like in the middle of the wall. And I'm probably just gonna put like a plant that'll grow down and then that will fill up the rest of the wall. But I love this. It has this speckly look. I don't really know what else to say about it besides it's perfect. Once I saw it, I knew that that's, that was exactly what I wanted to do was put that next to the TV. And this was only $24. So the next thing we have was more of a spontaneous purchase for me because these kind of things I have a hard time like visualizing what I would even do with them when I saw this I knew exactly what I wanted to do with it and it is this cute little stool look at that what I want to do is put this in our guest bathroom like our spare bathroom I guess you can say with a big plant and I think that that would look so good and just fill up empty space of the bathroom because the bathroom is looking pretty bare and I just neglected it I haven't done anything with it I need to put some paintings on the wall or something and it was $30. Like, I don't know about you guys, but like these things can be expensive and for $30, <laughs> It's pretty freaking good. So the next couple of things are pillows and two of the pillows are actually for this bed because since we have a king size bed now I've been finding that like our little pillows here just aren't doing it justice. So I wanted to get big king size pillows that are really gonna like make the bed look big. Just make it more like grand looking I guess you can say. And so I just got these big freaking white pillows. I can barely even fit them in the frame. They're really like nothing special. Like they they're just white. They're actually gonna go behind all the, these pillow sets. I think I might actually have to get one more depending once I set it up I'll see but if we do have to get one more um, Then I'll just go back and get it plus then I'll know if I like really like them But I'm just so excited for them to look so good <laughs> And then the next pillows that I got are for our couch. They're super simple They're actually so comfy like I would probably choose to be on one of these um, If we were chilling on the couch like watching movie and it'll bring a tiny bit of color to the living room Room. I actually put them on the couch before I did this and I kind of found that like it gave it more of like a beachy look and I really liked it which I did not think that I was into that like white beachy look but apparently I am so anyway we got two of those each of them were $30 
And then I actually ended up getting another one. This was actually from Marshalls. Um, we went to both HomeSense and Marshalls. This one was only $24 and it is adorable. It looks so cute. Got the tassels and just like that super like gray neutral element to it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. That's my task right now is to gradually buy pillows because they're expensive, you guys. Pillows are freaking expensive. Um, I think that like that haul of pillows is at least $100, which is insane saying like I probably would not want to spend another hundred on pillows for a very long time okay so now this this is actually really funny because this next item was actually an item that I just thought that I kind of needed for the house today I literally said in the morning I was looking up online light fixtures and then I saw the lady who literally told me that I should get a light fixture for my bedroom at home sense and that is how I figured out that home sense was open so I, it was so funny because when she was at the home send she sent me a picture of this and then I went and I freaking bought it this is so cute and this is actually going to be in this bedroom and we have a light fixture right above me here and that's where this is going to go all right now I got this it's basically the same look if you guys can see that let's see it's the same look as the hanging pot that I got. It is just a flower pot. I actually have no reason for it. <laughs> I just thought it was so cute and it was only $30. So I was like, I need to get that. I have an idea of where it's going to go. I think I'm gonna put it in the hallway, um, actually just outside of this room because I wanna put a big plant there. <laughs> oh my God, you're so dirty. No. Holy. I just spent three hours out there. Oh, wow. All of the holes are so good now, though, good. besides that one. Okay, let me finish this. Do you like my stuff? What's this for? Here. Okay, cool. Do you like it? Yeah, I love it. I think it looks so good. I love it. I love it, too. How much was the haul? <laughs> Tell me. I spent a little bit of money. <laughs> okay, I'm pissed. I was taking the stuff out of my trunk, I pulled out the pillows and I cracked one of the bowls I bought. What bowl? It's downstairs in the garage. On the garage. Sure? I don't know. Oh, babe. I overdid it. <laughs> you always do. I know you do. It's on your forehead. That's why I said, holy crap, you're so dirty. So can you close the. Minutes. Can you close that? literally five minutes. All right, so the next thing I got is actually something that I wanna put on our coffee table and I'm gradually buying these as I go because I wanna make sure that I buy ones that are gonna look good on the coffee table and it is books. So one, first, obviously I'm probably gonna actually use this book because this is the Oshi oh Glows cooking book and I don't know if you've ever had one of these but my friend Emma does and I borrowed it from her and there's such good recipes in here, like really good clean eating recipes. But at the same time, it also is a beautiful book to put on your coffee table because it's just bright and crisp and it's like elegant and it just looks really nice and then on top of the book you can put like stuff like this and yeah you know what I'm saying if you guys want to see what these end up looking like you can follow me on Instagram because I'm sure I'm going to be posting about these so the next things I got are just kind of like little things that I just found like in that impulse buy section you know like when you're walking down the aisle and you're just surrounded by a bunch of products and you're just looking at both sides when you're walking down and that is the impulse aisle and I fall for it every time. I actually kind of want these things anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I did end up buying a dry brush and I've been wanting one of these for so long because they're really good for your circulation and I have such poor circulation down to my feet and my hands. And it's also good for getting the dry skin off. Who knows how often I'm going to do it, but at the same time, the fact that the option is there, I probably will do it like once or twice a month, maybe. Only $8, so like, why not? And then the next thing I got was some natural deodorant, and I've actually been wanting to get some natural deodorant for a very long time, because one, sometimes I get like rashes in my armpits. I don't know, I think it's my deodorant. It's like, it just makes me irritated, and I have very sensitive skin recently. The second thing is that I've heard that sometimes your deodorant can actually mess up your hormones, so I just wanted to switch over to a natural one, see how that goes. This one is called Natural Formula, the Healthy Deodorant. I'm excited to try this out, and it was $13, which actually is very expensive for a deodorant, but at the same time, if it works for me and if it like makes me feel better because I'm not getting a rash under my armpits, I will probably continue to buy it. That is my first HomeSense haul of 2020, and yeah. Wait, is it my first HomeSense haul of 2020? 
It probably is. Anyway, that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to click that like button. Subscribe to my channel. It helps me out so much. Peace out, you guys. See you in the next one. Thank you.